So the first thing to define in order to have a good landing pattern is your target. So where do you want to land? Some drop zones have some X's on the ground and or cones that you can use as targets. Then you want to determine the wind direction and speed. This way you'll be able to make some adjustment to your landing patterns because wind has an impact. You also want to be a little bit aware of the descent and the forward speed of your canopy. If it's the first time you're jumping with it or it's a rental gear, well just ask a coach about that specific canopy versus your weight. What is his take on that? But if you're jumping your own equipment, you're most likely getting used to the flight path of your canopy.